It may not have the glamour and prestige of Hollywood and Cannes, but the Dungog Film Festival does have the distinction of being completely Australian. Over the next four days, film buffs will be making their way to the tiny town north of Sydney for a local movie extravaganza. The historic Dungog Theatre is the longest continuously running cinema in Australia and will host dozens of local flicks, including three world premieres. Among them is the opening night film Lou, shot in Mwoolumba in northern New South Wales. Because Dungog is a celebration of Australian film and Australian film only, and I really think that's something we should be celebrating. Celebrating at the moment, you know, we, I think too often we're a little bit um, cruel to our own industry. What's going on? He kicked me. I did not. British veteran actor John Hurt joined Emily Barclay and newcomer 11-year-old Lily Bell Tindley on location for the five-week shoot. He just has such an absolute joy for what he does, which I think is, is, is probably part of his incredible longevity, you know, he, he just delights in it. It's the fourth year that the normally sleepy town of Dungog will be welcoming in the film crowd, most of them heading there by train. Like the curtain raiser, the closing film Subdivision was also shot in regional Australia, in this case Harvey Bay in Queensland. In between will be a smorgasbord of features, documentaries and film coaching classes. Anne-Maria Nicholson, ABC News.